Omnipodzine.com. Thanks for joining me for another video beer review. This time we've got a bottle of beer from Omnipolo, and this is a brewed in collaboration with Siren and a, a guy called Dave Strachan. So Dave was the winner of Omnipolo and Siren's uh, annual homebrew competition. So this is a coconut maple toast imperial porter called Lorelei. It, is, it uses um, toasted coconut and maple syrup, so it's 10.5% ABV. Have had a small amount of this uh, on draft, and really enjoyed it. I mean, on on on, um, on paper, it sounds absolutely incredible. Incredible, doesn't it? I mean, it's my perfect kind of beer. Just of these ridiculous, big, sweet, flavorful imperial stouts from Omni I think this is brewed Duggars. Dugas in um, Sweden. Uh, yep, so pretty much jet black. You know, it's great. Really dense. Look at that darkness of that head. Really kind of like dark, kind of like slightly. It's like khaki in a way, like dark khaki. So let's give it a swirl and sniff. Check out the aroma. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Loads of vanilla. Loads of vanilla. You, at the back end, you do get those, the acidity of um, kind of dark malts and. Potentially oats, I don't know if there is oats in it. Yeah, loads of maple syrup, but like a real nice, rich maple syrup. It's not cheap and sugary, it's a real rounded flavour, full. Not getting a hell of a lot of coconut, I think there's other, there's bigger, bigger aromas in there, that's why. Yeah, it's kind of dark roasted malt. The acidity of like dark roasted malt and potentially oats. So it's got a minerality in that sense, I guess. Yeah, coffee, like a real sweet coffee, loads of kind of brown sugar. Slight, slight leathery note. Marzipan. But yeah, it's, oh, it smells incredible. Slightly floral, I guess, and maybe. Kind of uh, fragrant in a way, not floral, fragrant, and maybe that's the, maybe that's the coconut. It's not coconut massive for me, but it's kind of like more maple syrupy, big roasty kind of like things. Not a hell of a lot of chocolate either, but it smells great. Let's dive in. Cheers. More on that sugary side of things. Lovely, lovely. I mean. Body, a little bit lower, I know it's an Imperial Porter. I mean, I, I remember Martin Carnell writing that the, the, essentially the only difference between a porter and a stout nowadays is roasted barley. I don't know if that's the case with this. But, yeah, kind of reminds me of drinking vanilla essence. <laughs> that's a real prominent flavour, it's that intense creme brulee kind of thing. Burnt sugar. Obviously maple syrup. Mm. Stupidly drinkable for its ABV. And it's quite simple in that regard. I'm going to say kind of bitter chocolate, honeycomb. Bitter chocolate, yeah. I'm getting a big roast espresso there. Not getting too chad, once again very sweet, sugary. And creme brulee. So maple, I'm sure, yeah, exactly. Maple by the absolute bucket load, but for me, it's definitely the more of that kind of like burnt sugar edge. Cook, coconut, no, but lovely, intense vanilla. That's beautiful. So that's a bottle of Lorelei by Omnipolo in collaboration with Siren and Dave Strachan. I hope it's Strachan. So if not, I'm gonna look like a fool. But if not, I'm looking forward to all those Americans trying to pronounce Strachan. Strishan, Strishan, Dave Strishan. <laughs> and if Dave, if you call yourself Strishan, it's striking, mate. Get over it, alright? <laughs> it's a 10.5% ABV coconut maple toast imperial pot brew. Do toasted coconut and maple syrup, and it is absolutely beautiful. I'm Rob from Popsy.com, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.